we're gonna make a stove and you can use lots of different things here i've got this old log right here you can do this out of a four by four or six by six but it's going to take you getting past the idea that you're burning something that may have chemicals in it here we go don't want it to be too long to make this Chainsaw will be a lot easier. Boom. There you go, we got two. All right, next, what you gonna do? You got your wood. We have to get a hole down through it. About, step this way a little bit. About two thirds down. Check out this. Oldie but a goodie. Look at that, it's a craftsman. It's gonna last forever. You know, new is not always better. Sometimes it is. So we're gonna see what we can do right here. So right in the middle. Good deal. What do you think? Good. Good. All right, so these shavings right here, you're gonna use those in just a little bit. So we're gonna take them off. Mm -hmm. Let me get them on your shoes. I'm gonna put them right there. All right, JT, we got a hole. Now, here's the fun part. Now we gotta get one down the side. We're gonna make an L. So we know this. Right down in there, about that far. So it's gonna be right above that knot, and then we'll make an L. Straight down into it, above that knot. We've got ourselves an L. We've got the hole right here, and the hole at the top. What do you think? Yeah. Got the hole, you see the light through there? All right, so this is going to be a little dangerous, and you'll be careful with it, so have fun, but be careful. Now, here we go. Let's get it ready. So I'm going to take, I'm going to put in the bottom hole some of these shavings. You just got to get some sticks. You don't need very many, and start shoving them down in your hole. I don't want to totally cut airflow off, so that's plenty right there. All right, good deal. What do you think, buddy? Good. Good stuff. So we got our sticks up there. Got our air down there with some little some shavings and all. It should be really good here. All right, looking good. All right, key to making this work is you got to make sure air is still coming out through here, coming out to the top. Not, it's not going to work. There we go. There's smoke coming out the top. Fire going on in there. Starting to come out. like a choo-choo train. As long as that wind's going in there, you see the wind going that way. So that means you know that the air is gonna come through there.
All right, so our rocket stove has some boiling water going with some hot dogs. What do you think, JT? Good. That's good. Look at it blowing. Bubbles everywhere. Let's let it bubble for a little bit longer. Okay. It really didn't take that long. I love you, Mama. They're boiling good. Check that out. This could be a simple way to get you some cooking going on while you're out in the woods. Or just something fun you could do at your house. That's right. I imagine this log we have going on right here, it's going to burn for a long, long time. Let's let this boil for a couple minutes. Should be good. A couple minutes is three minutes. I like three minutes. One, two, three. It's wiggling. All right, so we gotta watch it. Let's kind of get a good look at this again. Air goes in there, comes out the hole you made. A couple minutes, you got some. Nice hot boil and hot dogs. I'm gonna take these off. And my son is hungry and let you see what's going on in there. The flame is really pumping out. I'll let this let this pump out for a little while and see how long this lasts. It could last for a long time. Come on, come inside. So it's gonna sit here and burn this whole time. I wonder how long it's gonna last. Let's go. Let's time warp it and see what happens. All right, now you wanna see. A little bit of what we got going on here. Little hot dog boil. Yeah. Why's the hole getting bigger? Get you a bite of that, yep. Yeah. Why's the hole getting bigger? Pretty good. Well, burn it up, JT. That's right. See how long that would last. Alright, let's do it. Say yeah. yeah. Alright, alright. <laughs> alright, so mama, what y'all all think about the rocket stove? What do you think? Pretty cool. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah, some things to think about. It is dangerous. It is not just for anybody. Watch your kids and your dogs and your wives very closely. Some things you can do. I saw I put some sticks around the top to elevate it. Put a little pot of water. Put hot dogs in there. Whatever you're cooking. You can take nails. Put up there. Make a nice little thing. You can also make other air holes around your piece of wood or your 4x4 or 6x6, whatever you're using. And uh, 
it'll burn a lot quicker, a lot hotter. Um, so just some things to think about. So it's, there's not just one way to do it. JT, what do you think? You want to add anything? To, what, you want to tell anybody? No. Thank you for watching. Fast food fitness is fun. It's all about good food and having a good time and just trying to stay fit and enjoy what we have around us. So thank you for watching again. And we are in the rocket stove. We are out. We're going to see how long it lasts. So I'll let that be the last thing. And when it falls over, I will tell you how long it lasted. And we're going to make you one. Have a great day. Go take care. Remember, don't forget to, if you like this, like it and subscribe if you like stuff like this and other things you'll see um, biking reviews running reviews shoe reviews camping trips canoe trips might shoot a bow and arrow might shoot a gun a jeep and comments that helps also bye bye So the stove is just about done. It's gonna keep burning for a while, but you can see it's collapsed over here. Turn in some really good ashes. Thanks for watching and see Whoa. you next time on Fast Food Fitness. That is cool. Say that again. That is cool. Say bye bye. Bye 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 bye. Bye 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 again.